my dear brothers and sisters in Jesus Christ. We are in the Holy Week in the Catholic Church as we are celebrating the great feast of Pan Sunday. On this day, every Christian holding the branches of palm leaves in our hands and we all should proclaim and shout with joy and welcome the King of Kings, Jesus Christ, into our hearts, our society and into our families. As we have seen in the Gospel passage, the great crowds that had come to the festival heard that Jesus Christ was coming to Jerusalem. So they took the branches of palm trees and went out to meet him, shouting, O Sana, blessed is the one who comes in the name of the Lord, the King of Israel. As it is written, do not be afraid, daughter of Zion. Look, your king is coming, sitting on a donkey's cloth. This is a great welcome for Jesus Christ. From the city of Jerusalem and all the people who have come for the feast of the Passover. According to the people, they thought that they are going to have a great king overthrowing the Roman kings and they were all waiting to make Jesus Christ the king of kings to rule them and to liberate them from the Roman kings and kingdom and to establish the peace in the society. As we hear the Passion reading, we see the same people shouting, crucify him, crucify him, because the people's expectations were not fulfilled and they all were disappointed. Being the obedient Son of God, Jesus Christ has come into the world not to be the ruler of this world or king of this human world, but he has come into this world to save everyone from their sins by sacrificing his life according to the plan and the will of God. And the crosses that we see in our churches, Jesus Christ crucified by nailing and pierced at his side. When we look into the history, the cross is the terrible punishment given to the human beings for their grave sins and mistakes and it is considered as a shameful and horrible to be crucified on a cross. But when Jesus Christ carried the cross and sacrificed his life on the cross as a ransom for all humanity for forever, the cross is no more considered as a shameful act or punishment given to the people for their sinful acts. But the cross is considered the symbol of our Christian faith and it is the pride of every Christian. And the cross is turned into a grace and blessing for all humanity. In the Passion reading we have seen the Son of God standing in front of humanity and the King of human very humbly and being obedient to the judgment on him to carry the cross and walk to the place of crucifixion through the streets of Jerusalem. 
it is all to fulfill the prophecies and the will of God. The King of Kings, Jesus Christ, gave us the cross to carry it and come to him. To live life according to the will of God and those who believe in the cross will surely reach the heavenly Jerusalem and have salvation. Only through Jesus Christ on the cross. Once again, let us all proclaim and sing and say with joy. O Sana, blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Blessed is the King of Israel. Amen. My dear brothers and sisters in Jesus Christ, on this holy day, on this Palm Sunday, let all our families, let all our societies, our country, may be experience, may experience and will have peace and joy of Jesus Christ. May Almighty God bless you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.